software testing project sir i am a manual tester i want to know what type of project should i do sir i am a fresho i want to see like which project should i add so that my resume gets selected and do you know right almost like 90% of the people actually are not able to get their resume selected you know what is the one reason the reason is projects yes guys projects are actually nowadays if you see right it's a key to get your resume get selected even as a fresho manual tester or as a automation tester right so in this video we are going to discuss about if you are a fresher right what kind of project that you can add for api automation and web all right i'm going to give you a list of the project that you can basically go through and generally that i personally recommend all the projects right in this video we are going to see that so let's jump into it so see as a so i'm going to discuss about this in a very different way which is as a manual tester as a fresher as a automation tester what kind of project that you can basically add right so let's discuss first with the freshers because freshers and non it people like they have a major disadvantage because many times they don't have any kind of a projects right so pay attention so see i recommend to do a open source e-commerce project because in this project right everything related to your login page registration page product listing page and other things right you will be able to grab it and if you are able to prepare yourself well for this project right because there are multiple e-commerce website for example we have open cart right we have no commerce right there are multiple websites where you can add those into your resume also right these are open source project and you can say that okay these kind of project that basically have done in my weekends right so yes so you can go to the awesomeqa.com/ui where you will find open cart already installed so login page registration page order item and dummy payment right this these are the feature that you can basically add it right apart from this you will find the bstack demo which are basically are helpful to test you out a very basic e-commerce website right so let me show you how this looks like for example if you see uh we have for source lab we have like this source lab demo which is available and similarly for browser stack we have bee stack demo right so both of them are a dummy kind of a project but you can definitely add them and they will definitely give you some advantage all right so apart from this let's see what kind of project that you can add right so as a manual tester if i would say right basic one i think you can go with the app.bw.com because here you will find as a manual tester right for example this project you can add as a pressure also right that yes i have gone through this website i have basically added i have created a test plan test cases right and you can see what is the process that i have basically gone through right so login registration forget password free trial remember me and create av so now uh, generally people ask this question sir can we add this project into your resume uh, that actually is not true because this is a uh, separate public website right so probably you will not able to add it to your resume but advantage of this is that you can showcase them that yes on weekends i have worked on it this is a test plan this is a test case that i have created so this is how you can basically increase your visibility in this case trust me it works okay bstack demo app dot uh, source lab this is what we have basically can try if you are trying with the medium level then e-commerce website of open cart is enough if you are trying with the advanced flows i think sign up email conversation right editor in the vw app dot vw dot com is amazing we have multiple combination that you can test and orange crm it is like traditional everyone use it right uh, let me show you this thing orange uh, crm which you can use or uh, which i think it's a dummy crm which is just customer relationship management project and definitely it will it will help you to give you the idea how different projects related to login registration and different crud operation basically works apart from this now let's discuss about automation tester what kind of project they can add right so suppose i am a automation tester and i want to basically learn about automation what kind of projects or websites are good handy for me right so basic websites i think bstack demo e-commerce website uh, i would say medium you can say with the open card you can go it now in advance i have divided into three part right the first one is it can be a sign up flow uh, of app.vw where you have a email confirmation so email confirmation you have to do through the apis so that's super important thing editor which has multiple multiple frames so multiple i frames multiple windows action classes dynamic locators if you are looking for some advanced project app.vw is the super super important thing that you can give it a try then you have a cybrus app.real app which is also very very important that you can also add it in this case okay now the super important thing which you guys are waiting right which are the websites i can use for practice so these are the website that you can use uh, for api i think i have basically created a single list let me show you 
uh, for manual testing ones and web automation right i have created this sheet is continuously adding i'm basically more adding more and more if you have some suggestions definitely put them into the comments we will add it right here you will see all the web projects right for example app.vw.com open card pstack demo tutorials ninja catalon studio web application that you can use for manual testing as well as automation for automation i think these three websites can be helpful uh, selector hubs xpath page is again an awesome one for api testing we have added for basic one you can go through this and if you are looking Looking for advanced like for example o2 flows right file upload authentication basic digest uh bearer token other authorization projects you can go with the imgur app.vw atlantian jira api and github apis i think these will be helpful for you so this is all about it i think these projects when you see right then definitely as a fresher if you are a fresher i would suggest go through the list and figure out which project that you want to add into your resume definitely you can add them into your resume as well as you can basically put them into a github profile and showcase them that yes i have created a test plan and test cases right but few of the projects that you see right for example app.vw and other websites which are not open source definitely i don't think you, you will be able to add to your projects or to your resume but you can say that sir I have done some training and where basically I have done these projects. So you can showcase them that yes, I have created a test plan and test cases that I think you can showcase while you are in the interview process, right? So not all of them you will be able to add into your resume, right? But if you are a manual tester and automation tester, I think for practice purpose, these websites will be helpful for you because they will basically cover most of the important automation as well as manual testing concepts that you are going to try. All right. I hope this was helpful. I will be keep on adding more and more websites for practice for freshers, manual testers and automation tester if you have any suggestion put them into the comments right i will be happy to add those into the list right thanks a lot for watching i hope it makes sense i'll see you in the next video and make sure you subscribe and if you're existing subscriber thanks a lot for joining in and if you're new please make sure you consider subscribing because i create videos related to software testing or test automation and help maximum users to basically get into the software testing all right thanks a lot for watching i'll see you in the next video bye